starting to feel kind of more comfortable, uh, getting more opportunity, and, and just sort of settling in from when you were first called up? Uh, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> I think it's once you get the rhythm, it's feels more comfortable to play and and uh, easier to get in the like the rhythm of the game. So, yeah. What's what's the biggest adjustment going from the American Hockey League to the National Hockey League? Just a lot quicker and and uh, uh, obviously some of the guys have like high end skill, so you have to be aware who's on the ice at the same time as you are. Um, play a game, team like New Jersey yesterday, a fast team. Uh, you're on the ice late in the game when they score the fourth goal. What can you take from that experience um, that you can take with you and you can learn from to help you become a better player? Uh, yeah. It was just kind of like a misread by me. I thought it was going to the, like the outside, but he cut inside and then I got caught on the wrong side. So. Has uh, having Jay Woodcroft as your coach at both levels kind of help you just really feel comfortable if, if you need to talk to him or when he talks to you, there's a good player-coach uh, relationship? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's easier for me that I know them from from uh, from the American League, so it's yeah, it's for me it's easier to talk to with them. Your uh, your minutes the last couple games have increased. Uh, you know, going with the six defensemen, does that kind of help you get in the rhythm of the game a little bit more? Have you found that in the last you know two three games? Yeah, yeah, I think it's just more comfortable playing when you get more on the ice. Yeah. What's your focus then right now? Like, what are some of the areas or an area maybe that you're really focusing on that you feel like you got to improve on to continue to get better? Uh, my uh, puck plays a little bit, and then just be more aware, like last night, be more aware, like when there's not a lot of minutes left to. Uh, Finish the game. Sorry yeah. that. Uh, Marcus, coming into training camp, one thing you mentioned was you wanted to get better at playing the puck and making more, what you said, better decisions with the puck on your stick. How do you feel like that's going for you in terms of when the puck is on your stick? Well, from from last year, I think it's gone better. So, so I see a little progress there. So, yeah, but it could be always better. How does one improve at that aspect of the game? I think for me, more of it's just to be more confident with the puck. So I feel like I'm a bit more confident now with the puck. Obviously, there's more like stick handling stuff you can do and all that kind of stuff. But uh, for me, it's been more just a confidence thing with the puck. You bring such a unique dimension to this Oilers back end. How much do you enjoy landing big hits? Uh, yeah, it's all right, <laughs> but it's, yeah, I'll try to play physical when it's, when it's time to, but I'm trying not to uh, chase for like a big hit or something. If, if it's there, I'll, I'll try to hit, but yeah, not try to get out of position or anything. <laughs> Are you thinking that there's, look, there's going to come a time where you hit somebody and they want to fight you? They wanted to fight you last couple of games ago. Yeah. Yeah, it's probably going to ha happen sometimes. Do you have fights in the minors? No. <laughs> fights in junior? No, never. So you've never had a fight? Yeah. Not in Finland, back in Finland either? No. Yeah. A couple of scrums, but nothing, <laughs> nothing, <laughs> nothing crazy. Yeah.